So what an update to my earlier video about the horrendous comments made by Kyle Gass during a Tenacious D show in Sydney, Australia. It appears now that the rest of the tours have been canceled. Yes, that's right. Remember when I said actions have consequences? Well, here you go. This is from the quartering over on X. Jack Black cancels Tenacious D tour after his bandmate wished on stage that Trump shooter hadn't missed. Now, this is the quartering's opinion here in parentheses. Jack did burst out laughing along with the crowd and appears to imply the band may well be... Oh, may... I can't talk. Appears to imply the band may be over as well. That was hard to spit out. So this is a statement from Jack Black. I was blindsided by what was said at the show on Sunday. I would never condone hate speech or encourage political violence in any form. Yet you chuckled at your partner's comment at his wish. <laughs> After much reflection, I no longer feel it is appropriate to continue the Tenacious Detour and all future creative plans are on hold. I am grateful to the fans for their support and understanding. Now, this was reported at many, re many sources. I'm pulling from Deadline here. Jack Black cancels Tenacious Detour, says he was blindsided by partner's Trump assassination comment. This is by Andreas Wiseman. Jack Black has canceled the latest Tenacious Detour and said that all future creative plans for the duo are on hold following his partner, Kyle Gass. Controversial on stage joke about the weekend's assassination attempt against former president and possibly future president Donald Trump. Actor, comedian, singer Black said today, I was blindsided by what was said at the show on Sunday. I would never condone hate speech or encourage political violence in any form. After much reflection, I feel no longer it is appropriate to continue the Tenacious Detour and all future creative plans are on hold. I am grateful to the fans. I already read that comment. So this gets into the, the comment made on Sunday, not 24 hours after the event happened on Saturday with former President Trump. And so, just to round this out, let's look at some comments, shall we? He only did this because he was threatened with deportation. This is from Senator Babbitt, Australian senator. There's no place in Australia for those who wish for the assassination of others. Ouch. It would not surprise me if he and Kyle talk like that in private, and this is just an attempt to save face. Jack Black laughed as his friend and bandmate made a birthday wish that they didn't miss Trump next time. Jack was at, was just at Joe Biden's guest of honor and speaker at his Hollywood fundraiser. He was not blindsided. He was blinded by the hate in his mind and heart. He has now canceled his tour. Hopefully he can get the help he needs. There's the picture of Jack with his... Um, I forget what they what they call that. Uh, Angry Brandon t-shirt on with uh, the president and former president. Uh, I'm actually surprised by this. Was his decision, was this his decision or did Venue start canceling? He knew exactly what he was doing. Hashtag tenacious douche. Jack has a much bigger stardom to protect in terms of Hollywood movies. Doubt he was bothered by it at the time, but after discussions about the backlash, decided this needed to be done to protect his career. So, yeah, most of the people are saying here, yeah, he screwed up. And now he's trying to save his own ass, basically. So, what do you guys think? Do you think there should be more consequences to his actions? Comment down below. While you're at it, please take the time to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Share this video out there with your friends and family. And with that, I will see you guys later.